I, I don't think a black or white undercoat makes much difference anymore, to be fair. Like in some in some situations, if you're going for a very saturated colour, then obviously white is going to help boost that colour massively. If you're going to be doing, say, Blood Angels and they've got loads of gold trim on them, it's like, well, it, does the gold paint that you like to use cover better over black or white? Because I bet that the red covers pretty well over both. So if you've been priming your models white because you wanted like a really nice vibrant red, it's like, well, would your red actually be just as vibrant if you put it over black? Yes or no? And then would that save you time down the line when it goes to base coating your gold because your gold actually covers better over black? It's like thinking further into the process rather than just majority colours. It's how does it affect the chain reaction down the line? Because like I said, a lot of colours will cover basically the same over both. Like you've kind of got this idea in your head of like, oh, this covers better over black. It's like, but have you tried it? 